Hello everyone and welcome to another how to do video and today I'm going to be showing you how to take apart this. It is of course a War Doctor TARDIS but obviously before this was a War Doctor TARDIS this was a normal 10th Doctor TARDIS and the reason that I'm taking this apart um, is because I've actually got a new uh, War Doctor TARDIS which I've made so uh, I will be doing a custom figure showcase on that in future of course uh, but this version is the old version and I am going to clean this up and this will become my 13th Doctor custom TARDIS uh, eventually, which you will see in future. But uh, I know that some people have asked me to take these apart or show them how to take them apart. So I figured now I've got one spare, it was a perfect time uh, to do this. So I have already started. Um, so if we look at the base, um, obviously what you have on the base, uh, I don't have the base plate to hand that's over the other side of the room, but basically you have uh, the standard screws in the base in these four places and then when you take the base off be very careful because you've got the springs of the doors that are normally in here and here you have the um, door opening um, tab which is normally there you have the spring tab for the sound effects here and then you what would normally be uh, the button tab for it to um, for it to work and uh, function the sound effects here and obviously this version you see all the um, electronics aren't there uh, this is because I bought this as spares repairs um, it's broken so again I apologize that I can't take you through how to dismantle all the electrics um, so I just want to say as well when you're dismantling your own be very careful when you're dismantling it and if you want to save the electrics uh, so once you've got the base off and taken all of that out the other thing you can do if you want to is you can uh, remove these two screws here which will uh, remove the front doors however uh, the springs that go in here are uh, very high in terms of tension and it does mean that it can be difficult to uh, remove them um, it can be difficult to remove them uh, later and also to refit them later uh, so I'm not going to remove them but you can do if you want to now once you've got all of that off the next step to do is to remove screws from these four corners here um, and that will remove, if I'm very careful, so that will then allow you to remove the base, the rest of the TARDIS from the base. So obviously then you've literally just got uh, the doors as they are um, still on the part of the base. So I'm going to put that to one side now. Um, so the next step you've got is you will have, and I'm trying to get this on camera right, um, you'll have a screw in here, 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 and here they need to come out and then on the roof as well on the inside uh, you have a screw there there oh, sorry I'm trying to <laughs> it's, it's very difficult to do this camera when I can't quite actually see the camera myself so you have a screw here 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 and here that need to come out um, and also one I believe up there and up there obviously I've already taken the screws out of all of this so you have to bear with me um, and pay close attention because I may, might miss one or two. So once those screws are out, the next thing to do is to take this roof piece off. Now, um, this is quite loose on mine, but what you can do and what I would recommend doing is you get a flat bladed screwdriver, a very thin flat bladed screwdriver under the sign, and then you can just use it to gently lever off. Now, obviously I've taken this apart several times, so this is much looser, um, but you need to be very careful when taking this off because what can happen, and I did it on this one, is if we look at this corner here, is that can happen. Um, I'll try and bring this closer to camera, where the actual corner part of the TARDIS has broken off and is still on the pin, um, which is an unfortunate thing uh, that uh, that does happen. Obviously, um, the TARDIS sign, uh, this is actually a modified version. This isn't the original uh, TARDIS sign that came with this one. Uh, this is from, I think, a, an 11th of the TARDIS. I swapped it, uh, I swapped it over. Um, because I wanted the uh, I wanted the clear version on this version, um, but obviously you can take that off. And again, obviously there will be electronics and everything up here, uh, which you have to be careful of. Uh, now the next thing to do, and again, I think I think uh, this isn't a worry if you've taken these screws out. Is very carefully you separate the two halves such as they are like that and those are off that's fine uh, so you've done all that now the next thing to do which i haven't done yet again i will put these bits to one side because we'll come back to them in a minute um is to take off uh the top of the door here so there's a screw in here and a screw in here 
Uh, you can probably take this plastic light bit out if you want to as well. I'm not going to do that, but you can if you want. So once you've taken those screws out, this should, or do I have to take that off? I think I might have to. Yeah, okay, I didn't know that. Um, basically, if you want to take this door piece out then, you have to remove this to basically lever it out, as you can see, downwards. Uh, so again, I'm not going to take that out, but obviously that's what you've got to do. Um, so then you've basically got the interior shell there. Um, which is good again just make a note of pointing this out for anybody who wants to add uh, a custom interior um, that's a good way of getting into it and getting to everything but obviously you've got to remember you will have the screws and everything underneath obviously i've taken out the um the uh, original interior out of this so let's put that to one side so let's go back to the roof now the roof here um we have this is a bit new to me as well so i'll have to do this on screen i'm doing this at the same time uh, you will be seeing it actually. So let's take this piece out. So I believe under this then we will have the lamp and then the lamp should, in theory, pop out like that. There you go. Um, so that's all you need to do for that part and that is the roof completely uh, dismantled. So next we come back to this piece. Now, um, interestingly enough, this is all one piece and on the classic um, TARDISes, these three panels are separate, but uh, they're not on this one. Now you can take the windows out on this and I believe there's usually two screws in, hang on, I've got to get onto camera to do this properly. I believe there's two screws, one here and one uh, here, uh, possibly one there as well, but I uh, obviously have already taken those out. So once they're out, just very carefully, you can just press the windows take that window out and then i believe that oh that one's just fallen out those two will follow suit and then you have the empty shell uh now the only other thing that there is left here is obviously uh the windows on the doors and the doors themselves as i said i've shown you how you could take the doors off now uh with the windows i'm going to try and take these out this one is actually stuck fast but i will take it out with this one is basically if you can lift out the edge of that frame you can slip the window out um now as i said i'm not going to do it on that one because that one is stuck fast i need to do that um i need to do that more carefully myself it's actually been glued in but that's but that is how you get um those frames out and again i believe as well as if you get if you take off this back frame piece the same way that this one sticks on if you take off this back frame piece um you can also take out the door because it is just plastic on a hinge um but that is pretty much it that's all you really needed to do um and there you have a uh a um war doctor 10th doctor tardis uh in its component many component uh parts um and yeah that's that's basically it so um i hope this is going to be useful for people who are also planning to do a um 13th doctor tardis obviously uh, as I said, uh, 13th Doctor TARDIS will be coming in future. Um, I have a, a date in mind, but well, I'm not going to say that date now because uh, it might not happen. Um, the eagle-eyed amongst you might have noticed on my shelves behind me uh, the shoes and the bottom of the coat of my 13th Doctor figure. Um, she is now finished. Um, but again, what I will be doing is I'll be showing her and the TARDIS in the same custom figure showcase. Um, so keep a lookout for them. They will be coming in future, but I just don't know exactly when that will be just yet. But uh, as it stands, that is taking apart a 10th uh, Doctor TARDIS. As always, I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, favorite, subscribe, share. It really helps me out a lot. And be sure to check out the description below for a link to my Patreon. There is an exclusive webcomic and rewards for people who support it. And the funding generated by my Patreon helps me fund future videos. I salute you all, and I will see you with another video very soon.